Yes, huu ni Eric Smith na nataka tu tugusie kidogo mambo ya worship, true worship. Na kwa nini tunabudu Yesu? Kuna kitu ambacho nataka tuzungumzie tu sahi. Kwa yule ambaye anatizama sahi, naweza kukuuliza what can you purchase as a gift for the person who has everything? Ni kitu gani ambacho unaweza pea mtu ambaye unajua ako na kila kitu? But still utaenda kununua gift. Sometimes tunaweza face hizo dilemma unazunguka kwa shops ukitafuta at least kitu ambacho unaweza mpea mtu na a gift that will have a meaning in that person's life and na wacha turudi sasa kwa Mungu wacha tu apply sasa kwa Mungu ni kitu gani ambacho unaweza pea Mungu what can you offer to god as a gift that he desire god knows all things and he possesses everything in this world all the treasures of heaven and even of the earth he does not need anything but there is one commodity one thing that god wants to receive god longs to receive from his children god desire for his children to freely boldly and passionately worship him in spirit and truth now we can go into the verse which are to read kidogo john chapter 4 verse 19 to 20 this was the discussion between the samaritan woman and jesus sa the woman says that is verse 19 sa the woman says i can see that you are a prophet our ancestors worshiped on this mountain but you jews claim that the place where we must worship is in Jerusalem now let us see is it strong holds ambazo sometimes zinatufungia ku worship zinakufungia tu because unajua kuna place ambapo nafaa kwenda ku worship ni wakati tu tuna meet on sunday kwa churches hiyo ndio place ambao wengi ambao tunafikiria ndio mali tu unaweza uka worship Zee, tukiangalia hii conversation between Jesus and the Samaritan woman kuna kitu ambacho tunalana hapo kuna hizo strong strongholds or obstacles that often prevent individual and churches from experiencing true worship as many christians have settled for the imitations of true worship some really get worship to a particular event or a building so tunajua tu ni mahali pamoja tu kwa church often worship is considered to be the music in a corporate service that is followed by preaching 
entire style of music. Kuna zile music tunajua hizi ndio music za present worship. Hizi ndio music. Kama hujafanya hii bwana we uja worship. Kuna hymns. Wengine wanaangalia kama haujafanya hiyo huja worship bwana. Lazima. <laughs> so still yes. The music can be an integral part of worshiping God. But we should note that Jesus does not mention singing. Wakati alikutana na huu. How I mention singing? Yeah. So when the apostle Paul spoke of Christ honoring worship in Romans 12 verse 1, he challenged us as believers to become living sacrifice so a true worship true worship rejects the strongholds is in rescue building rescue churches so true worship rejects that because it prevents the followers of Christ from responding to God with heart, soul, mind and strength in loving recognition of God's glory and love. Yeah. So that is akili yetu unajua hizi building sometimes kuna mtu anaweza kuwa anaenda church unapata saa nyingine akili yake haiko church. Anaangalia building. Unapata anaangalia eh hii building iko aje. Na watu ni watu wangapi wako hapa? Na watu wachache hivi. Mm. <laughs> Umeget. So unapata hizo vitu zote zina ku distract. Kabisa. Umeongelea hizo distraction kwa yes. zile hizo ma stromble, hizo ma yes. the things that actually limit us. Yes. Hata pia even church program can limit you. Yes. Umezoea tu mkiingia church ni kuinua mkono, kukaa, kutoa sadaka, kusikiza. Eh, and so, that is kutuwa sadaka, mm, unapata sangine zina kudistract. Zina kudistract, mm. yeah. yeah. And that is so powerful. Thank mm. you so much, Eric Smith. God bless you. God bless. And I really like the Romans chapter 12, verse Amen. 1. Wow. Yes, you offer your body as a living sacrifice. No, kisama verse 2 inaendelea, kisama do not conform. So if you conform, yeah. you are limiting yourself yes. to worshipping God. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Kuna zile tu mitindo za dunia, Kuna zineza kulimit zine kabisa zine kuworship kulimit. mungu. Okay. So offer yourself as a yes. living sacrifice. That's the best worship you can give God. And I hope you've been blessed. It has been amazing. Thank you so much, Eric Smith, yeah, for the word so. and for joining us today. Ubarikiwe. Mi ata si wisi. Ni tase maaj. Ubarikiwe, ubarikiwe, ubarikiwe sana. Thank you for hosting me. Thank you for coming.